Hello, how are you? I have a Dollar Tree haul. We have repurchases. We have, I think, some favorites in here. Um, some new items, some wish list items. There were some things that I went in there to get that I did not find, but I mean, that's how it is sometimes. Um, I'll start off with, with this one. I've seen these stickers in there before. We probably have two, but I grabbed them because um, boyfriend needs a new notebook. Okay, he has, um, let me show you guys here. He has this little like notebook here. So I wanted to find something similar to this. And I didn't see any in there that weren't like girly, you know, kind of thing. Um, so anyways, I thought I would get him something like this and then decorate it with the little monkey stickers because he loves monkeys. Um, and I like that they're kind of puffy too. And they look all, um, they look like they're wilding out, you know, like real funky monkeys. And he likes that. Um, so anyways, but yeah, I didn't find them and I need... A notebook also uh, I purchased this one before I've damaged it obviously <laughs> I purchased this at uh, the Dollar Tree and I just put like little stickers on here but this is one of my like dance workbooks kind of thing and I'm through with this one so yeah I need I need another one for this um, season so anyways I'm guessing I'll either purchase some of those items somewhere else or yeah. But anyways, uh let's let's get into the haul. So this is a favorite and a repurchase. I thrown out the other one. I just figure like every few months or so I'll get a new one. Cause I mean I could disinfect it, sanitize it, whatever, but I think, you know, after a while, you just need to uh, get a new one. So I grabbed this for, like, hard-to-reach cups and things like that. Here's a repurchase. I like the Good Scents kitchen bags. Um, I didn't see the spring scent. Again, I didn't see it. So, but I th I'm thinking I'll like this lemon one. They have vanilla scent, which not my favorite i don't mind it like if i'm gonna put some kind of laundry in there or something um and they also had a fresh scent and i think that one i would be okay with also i may have even purchased that one before but there is a difference like this one is a flap ties and some of the other ones are the drawstring uh ties or whatever and this one it says two bags free so there's 14 in there and they're 13 gallon bags and then I found some of the bolero. So these were wish list items and they're somewhat new. I know everyone's been hauling them. They did have the lotions and the face wipes and the oils, but I'm I'm a fan really only of the um of the soap bars. So this one is honeysuckle and green tea with the newer packaging. And then this one is the coconut oil and sea salt. So these are 6.25 ounces. Yeah, pure vegetable soap. Um, there's some more info. And yeah, I think the packaging on, on these are really nice. I like it. And what else do I have in here? For my little critters that thankfully have not been showing up so much, but I want to keep it that way. Some of this, this seems to work. Um, I have to do an update on that video still, but um, this has worked. I was testing this out. This has worked. And you reapply this like every two weeks, um, like two cracks in that, those kind of areas. And then this is the orthoboric acid. And so this is the same thing. Um, you place it in cracks or like under your stove. You want to keep it away from um, like where you're, like if you have pets, you want to keep it away from where they could grab it. So it says once you apply this, you kind of sweep it, you know, away from getting 
into like any food areas, things like that. So I would say you have to be pretty careful when you're using this. And when I use this, I have my windows open and the whole thing and a fan going because it this one smells pretty strong. So going to test this one out before I do an update to that War on the Roaches haul that I had, one of my earlier videos. And then moving on, I didn't get so many food items, but I got uh, just a couple things for the week. Some tuna. I love this for a quick like in between meal small meal and the kitty loves these so i got her one of those my receipt i grabbed about 20 items okay and here's the frozen item i like this brand the picked sweet so i got the broccoli the mixed vegetable and the spinach they also had the okra um they had a few other items i think green beans too and then um i only got one bag of the frozen fruit the tropical blend i'm going to steer away from grabbing anything with berries in it because I've had a couple instances where I've, I've had kind of like an off-putting, like either they were spoiled, 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 I don't know which one it is. Um, yeah, I'm not so sure. So the plain blueberries, I haven't, I haven't, I don't recall having any issues with those, but sometimes the frozen strawberries or the mixed berries, those two are the ones that are kind of, mm, I'm not so sure. So, but I'm fine with these the mango and the peaches if anything with the peaches sometimes i feel like they're not fully ripened like a full flavor but that's that's okay so let me know if you've had any like um you know bad experiences with the frozen fruit there i have heard others um like other youtubers or YouTubers saying that they've had um, issues with the frozen fruit. But anyways, we'll see. So, and then the last few items I have here. Some repurchases. Toilet paper. Ran out. And paper towels. Now, I never even realized it until today that there's two different excuse me um like brands of the paper towel there's this one and then the other one is like the home store brand and i'm thinking i like the home store brand more than this one i'm gonna try these out and see if i like them um yeah well yeah i just i didn't even realize that then I saw this I thought it was super cute espresso yourself and if you know me you know my um, love and appreciation for all things coffee it is the Jot brand so it's a journal there's 60 sh sheets 5 by 7 inches and um, it does have the line taper in here but yeah um, the espresso yourself is in like a teal aqua foiling and then um you have your little latte here with the heart and the coffee beans right here super cute i couldn't i couldn't pass it up with my love for all that so and then the last few items are wish list items i saw this hauled or being hauled and um, either I saw it being hauled or I saw it in like a come with me video. But um, I saw this print and I love it. So it's this kind of tropical beach theme. So, and I think, um, I think if I see more of these items the next time I go into the store, I'll probably grab some more 
Um, cause they had other, they had bowls and, um, kind of like a teardrop shaped platter like this. So yeah, so I got that and I got the little dish drying mat. I think I love this the most cause you see a little blue in there. Super cute. And on, I don't know if you noticed, but on the other underside, it's like a lime green color. So you could flip it around if you wanted to. And then um, this one. I really like this shape, this square shape kind of bowl. Um, it just works well for me. I find it very useful. And um, so anyways, yeah, and it has the same print around it. So I'm not one to get like matching sets of things. But that's really cute. So I don't know. We'll see. And I guess I forgot one last item. I got some crepe paper. Crepe? Yeah. Crepe streamer. I didn't even know this. It says it's flame resistant and bleed resistant. I didn't know about that. Um, here's some more info. So what I'm going to use this for is to make some paper flowers with the crepe paper. So I just got plain white. That way if I want to, I could like add some coloring to it or something like that. But yeah, I haven't made the flowers in a while out of crepe anyway. So we'll see how that goes. But anyways, yeah, that's it you guys. Uh, besides my little Dunkin' Donuts that I'm gonna eat later, finally some donuts for me, some little munchkins. Here in Chicago, we can get five for a dollar the munchkins or 10 for two dollars plus tax so i just got the five because i figured um like they get you know how they they don't stay like soft and everything so yeah you guys that's it for my haul not a huge haul not a tiny haul just a few things that i needed and wanted wish list items and now I'm going to get something to eat and put all this stuff away, edit this video for you, <laughs> and yeah, do whatever little doodad stuff that I have to do around here. There's always something to do, right? So, you know, thanks for stopping by and watching the video. I hope you saw some things that you want for yourself or need or um to find useful you know to use in your home in your life be sure to let me know down in the comments um you know about the frozen fruits or any of these items if you've tried them and you like them or yeah or what are you seeing in the dollar tree that you're on the hunt for anyways yeah that's it so give this video a thumbs up uh Share this video with your friends or anyone else that you think might be interested in anything that I mentioned here in this video. And I'll talk to you later. Ciao.